Hey, good morning, guys. Tush coming at you Saturday morning. It's uh, about uh, quarter to six, I think. Uh, just heading out for a Triumph Club event um, called Spring Fling. It's actually a uh, it's actually a shared event between uh, the Toronto Triumph Club and the MG Car Club of Toronto. Um, so we're going up to Aurelia, Ontario, a place called uh, the Fern Resort. So. Got her plugged into the GPS, acquiring satellites, and uh, got a bit of a drive to get there this morning. I'm meeting up with one other car, so uh, everything's looking good. One more thing before we go, I got a little bit of a mail call this morning. Uh, picked up some mail from the mailbox. Here we are. So today, you probably recognize the envelope. A lot of you. So I've seen a lot of mail calls. I think this week. I just uh, open this up if I can with one hand. Check. And there we go. Cecil, thanks very much for the sticker. It's my first one. So today, Cecil, you're going to have a place of honor. You're going to be riding shotgun uh, beside me in the TR6 today. So thanks very much. Uh, you're going to have a Please great day. Drive to highlighted route. And we're going to drive to the highlighted route. All right. We'll talk to you later. Bye. Looks like it's going to be a nice day, sun's just coming up, I don't know if you can see that at all. It's supposed to be okay today, it's not going to fall into rain, which is good. So, all systems go, I'm going to get some gas. So I made it to the resort, still a little cold to swim though I think, plus I didn't bring my suit. Looks like a nice place, you know, right on the water. I'm pretty quiet still. This is sort of cottage country up here, so a nice view of the lake. Yeah, it's looking like a nice day. So I'm sure our route today will take us around the lake. I'll try to get some shots along the way. So yeah, it's looking good. Nice and quiet. You hear the birds chirping. Anyway, we'll catch up with you later. Doing a little line up in front of the hotel. Alright, I got everybody in one. I don't know who owns that green one there. It's not in the not in the best of shape. It's a little rough. Um, well, he's doing his best. He's doesn't, trying. It doesn't quite uh, fit in with the group. So. But my god, those tripod headlights look great. Take a shot of this here, leave it at 9 o'clock. Nice tier three. All alone? My mom is there. There's a nice uh, beater TR6. <laughs> beer. Be nice. Oh no, gosh no. <laughs> Don't know who would want to drive in this. Oh, dear. He's right here. He's got that green, uh, green, green yeah, CR. Okay. And, uh, Second group of cars to go on the tour. They're doing it in uh, stages of four today. Got an oddball Sprite. Beautiful car. Archie? Yes. How are you doing? Great. How are you doing? Good, thanks. <laughs> That's why he's the ex-president.
Group number three. All the way from New York. So which way are we going? Are you navigating? Where we're going to go on this trip? No. Basically we're going up here and up the bow and up around the top end. So we're on our way up to uh, Lake Rosso for lunch. Uh, I'm in a little bit of a car show. So I'll take some more video when we get there. Uh, in the meantime, we're stuck behind a tour bus. Uh, there's a big casino up here called Casino Rama. And I'm sure that tour bus will be pulling into Rama, which is just up here on the right hand side. So hopefully, once that uh, tour bus is clear, we can catch up with the rest of the group. But a uh, beautiful day. Not sure of the temperature. It's probably around 20 degrees Celsius. There's the casino coming up on the right hand side. Pretty big casino. They'll take your money pretty quickly. So we try to stay out of there. We try to spend our money on the car instead of gambling it away. Not sure which is worse.
just at our lunch uh, location. Beautiful view. Okay. Hey, tell John you're gonna have to pull his man card for parking over here. Just, yeah, I asked him what kind of MG that was. There were no spots left. Yeah, it's a funny looking MG. He's in the MG section. I'm not quite sure. He's old though, so maybe he hasn't quite figured out. I uh, lost my preeminent position when I had to stop and pick up the, uh, the uh, ring for the headlight. It was very gallant of you. I thought it was, <laughs> yes. So yeah, the this is the Spring Fling uh, car show, the MG's uh, park in one area, and are voted on by the uh, Triumph group. And then the TRs are parked in one other area and voted on by the MG folks, so it works out pretty well. So a good display. And then we got the, uh, the Sprite again over with the MGs. Nice LMGA. Nice in the shade. Triumph section. This vote is the, the no car. vote for the red. No name. The red no name car. car. Just say the red car. Vote for the red car. I don't have any lots of toys and electric stuff. Yeah. Like stereo with it's a pretty, uh, the original, uh, pretty dirty and dusty and uh, dinged up engine bay. Pretty, yeah, I think it was pretty, pretty disappointing. Striped hoses. Not sure if those striped hoses are actually striped hoses or some sort of. the shroud. This last time. the shroud. Movie star? Yeah, yes. Jacqueline, what's going on? I'm going to read my book. Okay. What book are you reading? Something good? Sins of Omission. Oh, that sounds fantastic. Seventy six, Tahiti Blue. Joanne, you're voting for your own car? You're supposed to vote for MGs. You're supposed to vote for MGs, not for your own car. Those are your driving shoes, Elaine? These are my driving shoes. I don't think these would work better. So 
So I'll just stop for ice cream in Gravenhurst. If you can read that. Got a couple old uh, steamships here, which are really cool. So they run regularly. Over there, Muskoka Steamship Company. They also do a big uh, wooden boat uh, works and a big wooden uh, boat works uh, museum over there, Muskoka Boat and Heritage Center. So it's kind of a cool place to come if you're into, uh, into old boats. And it's not as busy as I thought it'd be. Still nice, all the same. Good place to stop for uh, good place to stop for ice cream. All right, back to the cars. Okay guys, home sweet home. It's about uh, 10.30. I don't know if you can see that or not. So, so 354.8 kilometers. Max speed was 114k. Moving time for uh, uh, 5 hours and 4 minutes. Stop for an hour. Moving average 70k. Overall average 58.3k. I think it's about uh, 50 kilometers short because I forgot to turn the uh, GPS on at one point. So anyway, probably another 400 kilometer plus trip and I'm happy to be home. And uh, we'll put it away in the garage and that'll be it for the night. We'll talk to you later.